again. So uh, it's easiest with encyclopedias because there's so few. Just know their titles and go right to them. So if uh, you know one of the two national encyc encyclopedias, which you're going to learn about later in this section, is called American Juris Prudence. So you can just put it in, and then it auto populates right there. And Westlaw, they have American Jurisprudence. There it is down there. Uh, they also have one called Corpus Juris Secundum. And there it is right there. So Westlaw has the two, and, and then uh, you know Lexis just has the one. So you just put them right in. You can also uh, go to them by going to like secondary sources and finding it there on Lexis. It's the same thing from the home page. Go to content type and secondary materials and, and you'll find it there. Now for the state encyclopedias, you can just put those in as well. So we have Michigan Law and Practice. There it shows up. They also have Michigan Civil Jurisprudence. Now if you're not sure what anything is, you can click on this little I. It shows up all over the place and it will tell you what, what it is. Like for instance, see this one here? It's a 29 volume encyclopedia. So you'll know you're not looking at a treatise, but you're looking at an encyclopedia. And the same thing goes in, in Westlaw. You can use the search bar or go to State Materials, Michigan, scroll down, and you'll see secondary sources. There's Michigan Civil Jurisprudence. So there's a couple different ways to just know the title in your brain and then go right to them. It'll save you some time. And it's a lot better than just going to a search bar, doing a, a basic search, and then trying to find an encyclopedia. Just go right to it, search within it, and then you're not going to be overwhelmed with too much information. See you back in the book.